Well, I'm curious to go on, I'd like to see one. Yeah, cool, good, love to hear that. 20, I mean, actually, you know what the original price? Yeah, that's my bag, sorry, lovely. I'm not, are you lying? So is that a team new job as well? No, I've had that for years. Oh, do I wish I could find some good little games to buy. Don't hate me, you told me last time not to worry, so I'm not worrying this time. Right, this is the go. only time I'm not going to worry. I wake up late. Be happy. Thank you, my love. Alright, let's go and do something, shall we? Morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good, good. Did you see your shoes on there? Yes. No, I haven't. <laughs> have you seen it? Yeah, I was watching. He's watching, I don't have any time. Well, that game was awesome for you. Which game was that? The retro one, I can't remember, with uh, Jay something. Was oh, the Jaguar. Yeah, 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 good, good score there. I should have bought it all, shouldn't I? Well, you, you wouldn't know. No, I got lucky. I got lucky. I'll come back and see what you got. So hopefully this footage should be a lot better today. I've played around with some settings as opposed to yesterday's. So we'll have to just see, won't we? How much is this one? I'll take that. Let's break, let's break the bank, shall we? Oh, uh, 20 and how much are all the little ones? Um, 50p, I take it. I'm not. I'm doing it for my daughter, and she's here somewhere. That's all right. One fifty. Uh, so She'll be back in a second. Couple that is now, mate. Don't get hold of Take out one. Three. How much are you sort of posting? Three. Uh, what are you after? Just roughly. Uh, one, yeah. Good morning. Thank you. What about this one? How are you, mate? Right? How about you? Um, that is two pound. It sings. It just doesn't move. And the head doesn't move. I'll have a go at that. I've also got these teddies in here. Sorry, my dear. Got a few there. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven teddies. Oh, it's manic this morning. You've been getting on alright? Yeah. I haven't seen you for ages. Okay, and um, what's wrong with these ones? Hey. They're five or eight. They're all worth everything. I don't think I need them to be honest, I'm being I greedy. They're the first version though. Yeah, first ones all, first ones are worth more, aren't they? And what about these? So you can have a lot for a quid. So, oh god. You know you want them. I'll have to, yeah. <laughs> and what about the chopper chop tin? Uh, we'll cut we'll cut the bag up in a minute, I'll let you okay. do it. Is there any in there? No. How about you? Now, do you know what I had? There you go. I had the uh, Spice Girls one a little while ago, oh, right. and it just flew out. I saw that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to come down there. Come on, there. There you go. You have a look through that. Everything that's in there is yours. I haven't bought anything yet. Beautiful stuff. Thank you. Brilliant. Hope you sell out today, mate. I like the whip. That's all right, take some credit. <laughs> Thank you. I'll come back and have a slow browse in a minute. Bargain, bless her. Lovely girl. You need to stop buying cheap shit though, mate. I mean, he's there. Can I strike him? Hi, or her? Hello. You all right? Yo, yo, an angel. The big one's yo, yo. Hello, yo, yo. Hello, angel. <laughs> I really want a dog. I'm, 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 I'm working on it with her. Oh. Bless you. How much are the boots? Please. Uh, do you know what size is it? Can I have a, can Eleven. I have a look? Eleven. Oh, that's looking yeah, good. Ex, um, ex, the army ones. Yeah, the Altberg's army, yeah, yeah, yeah. shouldn't they? Yeah. Oh, I'm in Eleven as well. Oh, yeah. What's the chances? <laughs> what, I'll sit on the best pick tower and the No, I think, I think for what I do, they're a, bit, they're a bit too far gone, but for somebody else, that's a bargain price, that is. Well, so, see, my lad had, always had two pairs when he was in the army, one for wearing every day and the yeah. big ones when he was and on the every, one. And they're the everyday ones. Yeah, possibly. <laughs> yeah. yeah, they're a fantastic bargain for somebody else. Yeah, and you can get them resold as well. But for what's there, they last two minutes for me. What do you do then? Just okay. all this kind of stuff and then I take walks and stuff. Lots oh, of I see. Somebody... Sorry, I shouldn't ask really, I'm nosy. That's alright, don't you worry. <laughs> you but thank, 
Yeah, yeah I'll, put, I'll turn them around so people can see what they are because they'll sell quick, they will. You reckon? Yeah, 100%. I know, but if you're 11. Yeah, but 11's a good size. Uh, wow. 11's a great size. Oh, anyway, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Yeah, look, you've already got money in here. You're loaded already. There you go, look at that. Oh, there's, 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 there's half a cent as well somewhere. <laughs> Tell me, is it is, what is, oh, it's spy stuff, isn't it? Yeah. Spies. <laughs> All right, thank you, my lovely. Thank you for showing me How much are the little Spice Girl figures? Uh, £20 for the set. Oh, they're, they're good ones, aren't they? Mm. I'm a tight ass out of my price range, but somebody will love them, <laughs> won't they? Thank you so much. Okay. What about the chest set? Ten pounds. Ten. Is that wood or marble? That's like wood, isn't it? It's inlay. Yeah. That's a bargain as well. I want marble though. I'm being fussy, aren't I, today? <laughs> and if it was marble, it wouldn't have been a tenner. Yeah. No. Thank you so much. Okay. Good morning. Good morning, how are you? Fine, thank you. How are you? How much is the bag? Um, four pounds. And how much is the bed in there? That's a sheet. Oh, is it a sheet? Oh, yeah. I still like it, though. How much is the sheet? Two pounds. It's the, the Mickey Mouse one. Okay. I'm going to take, I think I'm just going to take, I'm going to take the bag. Right. So we're in for four. Okay. Oh, can I walk on this? A bit too late at that point, weren't I? <laughs> big, big toy car. <laughs> oh, are you four quid? What change have you got at the minute before I start messing you around? Well, I've, I can cope. I've got a tenner, I think. I can cope. You can? Yeah. So there you go, professional car boot, well, isn't there, yes, you two? Yes, we are. We're ready for that. <laughs> I'm not today. I normally go to the post office before. Just the bag, please. <laughs> I wasn't even going to bother this morning, which means I'm going to find some good stuff, isn't it? Yeah, you will, see. We'll give you some change now, look. That's right. Is that all right? Yeah. That's close enough, don't you worry. It's close enough. Thank you very much, Thank I appreciate you. it. Was that all right? I won't even haggle on it. Don't be scared, James. What are you buying, Tom? Golf balls. Oh my goodness. Whose stall is this? Yours? Yeah, yeah. How much are the teddy bears? With each. Where were you? Did you get a text? <laughs> no. I'll, no, text you saying, I'll, text, I'll text you saying, just to let you know, I'm going to break you out. Oh, there you go. Yeah, it's come through. <laughs> yeah. Have yeah, you, got, you haven't got them. I don't know, you didn't bring no, them. No, I didn't bring them. No, I'm so right. sorry. Thank you, mate. I appreciate no, it. Right, uh, Pat, I'm so sorry. I'll text okay. you saying, I'm just going to pre-warn you now. I'm, I'm going to break you out. We thought you was doing one. We was like, Wait, well, I was going to do it. <laughs> well, how much is the tracksuit? Right, I'll let you crack on, Ricky, mate. Yeah, see you, mate. Media. But for a tracksuit though. It's a five of the set, yeah? Yeah, that's it. I think I might, you know. Well, I will. I'm almost on bag number two already. What else you got? What else can I buy? The R set over there. Nah, not for me, them things. I've had a go on that bloody Oculus, send you into a different world, didn't it? <laughs> Out have you got change for a tenner or not mate? Yeah, have, mate. If not I can come back. Oh, let me look and yeah, see what you got over there as well. Let me have a look and see what you got over here yeah, as well, just in case I can just in case I can split it down a bit more. Yeah, I've been told to take all the trainers home, so that's why they're still <laughs> left in the car, you know. Oh you gotta keep oh you gotta keep them, have you? I mean, sorry, I've got I weren't gonna go through your boots, I don't worry. Yeah, sorry mate, just that track yeah, sheet then sorry, please. Yeah, Good Beautiful, thank you, mate. Good mate. Here, you too, man. Back in there before I lose it. And we keep on going. Thank you. Oh, yeah, Dad, he's going he's gonna to wipe all your cash out of here. You've got your hair cut, you've got all this over there, so people yeah. can see. <laughs> How are you getting on, you're right? Now, this morning is the first time I've woke up and gone, oh, I've got messy hair, I need to wear a hat. Whereas before, it's always a messy hair, so I don't mind having yeah. one day off, it's fine. All right, boy. Whoosh! See, I keep seeing everyone pick these bloody things up. I can't hold of them, could you? What those? Yeah. What's his name over at bloody... Slothy boy in that. Sloth 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 if, if it's a vacuum cleaner or a bread maker, he picks it's it up, doesn't he? Sloth or whatever, yeah. yeah. He keeps buying it, isn't he? I just... 
I just can't. Look inside them and they're, I mean, that one's. Yeah, that's lovely and clean, that one. Yeah, I've, I've, I bought a few before, but I just, I just can't be bothered. Packing them up and then posting them. Yeah, I can't be bothered. It's a lovely bread maker, by the way. Yeah, it's a lovely bread maker. bread maker. But it's very clean. Yeah, very clean. <laughs> How much are you little teddies that in here? <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to put some in the bag. My hands have got one, two, three, four, and I'm going to go again. Oh, I've got no strength in my legs today. No, 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 you're all right. It's a good workout. It's a free workout. That's my bag. Sorry, lovely. Oh, sorry. That's okay. Everything's for sale. All right, that's five. All right, five. Is that a quid, is it? Uh, yeah. Take two quid. Thank, Thank you very much. So I appreciate much. it. Just some teddy bears, but obviously it's cheap, so it's just doubled up. <laughs> Thank, right, Thank you. Thank so you. Much. Have you got any um, unicorny bits? Unicorn? No, we haven't. We've outgrown the unicorn. Yeah, she state, ain't yet. <laughs> I'm afraid. Um, and the clothes, it's like well, I haven't got kids, but I've got some really nice ladies stuff. I wouldn't know about ladies. She likes leopard print actually, but you'd never you'd never get her in a skirt. Alright. Oh, Is this all ladies oh, in here? She? I want about my miss my missus now. Alright. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's four. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. I think I'm gonna leave it there. Alright. Yeah, thank you all so right, much, no I appreciate problem. it. Thank you. Oh, some more bits over it. Hello, mate. If I see a dog, I'm going to stroke it. Yeah. <laughs> if I get a bit, it's my own fault. Well, that's a nice looking top, isn't it? See, that's a bit more of me, but oh, so small tees. Never mind. Thank you so much. Right, no problem. Nice little jelly bundle. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were talking to me. I oh, am. Yeah, you've got a nice little bundle over here. Nice little selection of stuff, haven't you? Yeah. But can I buy anything? James. Yeah, loads, man. James, you're not a panic attack boy, you are, aren't you? <laughs> We've got different mindsets, me old mate. Oh, look at these pre cut tags for my daughter. Who's got all the tags off? Yeah, my daughter hates tags, they have to be cut off. Yeah, no unicorns, though. She likes unicorns. <laughs> Hello. Hello, mate. Oh, sorry. I've recently moved to Newbury, yeah. and I've watched things like Richard reselling and such. And then your feed came up. Oh, okay. And then I looked at that. Hey, oh. I know that car. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, How you doing, mate? You right? Pleased to meet you. What's your name? Peter. Peter. Nice to meet you, nice Peter. To meet you, man. Do you enjoy watching that sort of oh, stuff? I love that stuff. It's what got me into doing the same sort of things. Yeah. Nice to meet you, Peter. Cheers, yeah. man. Nice to meet you. I hope you find some stuff, dude. I already have. Good man. Good man. Big up, Peter. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. oh, yeah. oh, I remember this store because I recognised that koala bear. What did I buy for you last week? Toys. Yeah. Yeah, I remember because I recognised the koala. Oh. I'm not here to complain. No. Oh, that's it. And I bought the teddy bear with the little fish in that thing. Oh, that's yeah. Of yeah, course yeah. you did. Yeah. Boring story, but just a good memory. That was all. Yeah. Thank you. Win some Christmas presents. Everyone a winner. No. What? Did, I'm confused. Oh, I see. I see. Have a go. Oh, I'll have, I'll have a go anyway. Go have a go. Come on, let's have a go. Let me have two goes. Two goes. Come on, then pick two. This is a clever idea, Whichever isn't it? Should you have a rummage and choose your teddy? Oh, I'll pick three there. Sorry, you go. I haven't looked. I feel like I just almost cheated the lottery then. <laughs> Right, we've got number two. Number two, so in this box at the end. And we've got number, I think that's a five. It looks like the last bit of the end's a five. Five, yeah. Two so and five. From that box, one. Here you go. So one's from here. This one. Oh, that's the seven, isn't it? Yeah. So look in there, there we go. From this one and one from that. Oh, this is a fun idea. I like it. Clever. What do I want? I'm going to put it there for a second. Did have a go? Yeah. First thing that grabs my attention, I'm going to get. Like a little backpack for kids who put toys in it. First one, number two. I'll put that back up there. 
Yeah, try and keep them in there, Toya. That's all right. And number five. Oh, this is fun. I like it. A bunny. There we go. Thank well you so done. much. That's, such, that's a clever idea. I'll think of that next time. No, I won't. I won't bother. Thank you. Thank you. That is a good way of getting rid of shit. Yeah, that is a good way. Come on. We well, are now. Wait, he's um. Is he doing all the work then? Are you, yeah, yeah. Quite, no, you spending? Fine. You doing the spending? Nah. I think people have a misconception about our already <laughs> sellers. We, 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 miss, we miss loads of stuff. So much stuff. I don't do to it. I like to, I'm at the point now where I look at if it fits into a small parcel or a yeah, thingy, so that, like that's what I prefer now. Do you know what I mean? Like some people will say to me, why don't you pick that up? I'm like, can not bother with it? Too big. Because too much just because there's profit doesn't mean you have to buy it. See <laughs> a bit. <laughs> Can't believe you saw that, by the way. <laughs> Too bad. I'll give you, I'll give you four. <laughs> Would you like to sell it for five? Yeah, I'll sell it for five for you, mate. Yeah, I'll buy that for five. <laughs> How much does he actually go for? I don't care. I don't know. Um, I sold Pikachu for 18, but obviously I had to ship it and stuff. I made, after 18, uh, so 6, 12, minus the fees, probably, oh, I probably, I probably made like six quid on it. Yeah. Yeah, I'll buy that. You sure? Yeah, yeah, mate. Does that make you feel a bit better now? Yeah. Do you feel like you're a bit like <laughs> evened out again now? It's all right, mate. Keep hold of it. I don't really know what changed for you. In fact, Pat, how much do you how much do you love me? Millions. Why? Good. Please, 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 please. Actually, Paul, how much do you love me? It's Paul's car. That's fucked. That's that's going on the back. That is, isn't it? I'm on the back. I've only been here today, Pat, and I'm only staying here, so yeah, you're not I'm not no rest I'm not today. rushing around today. But whereas before, when I normally see you, I've been up. In five hours already. Yeah, see you tomorrow. Yeah, see you in a bit. Thanks for that, Pat. I appreciate it. Yeah, that's alright. We don't mind you coming robbing us. I might be coming to rob your store in a minute. You got some funky looking bits, didn't you? Yeah. Hey? Woo! Yeah, I'll come and see what you got for me, Paul. You don't know. James don't know you're beautiful. How much are your teddy bears in here? Uh, £100 each. Go on then. <laughs> <laughs> well then you set the price. Happy with that. Now how much are they, mate? Uh <laughs> like a little one, the little birdie one. Uh pound. Yeah, I'll buy him for sure. I'll buy him. I just saved ninety nine pound then, didn't I? I just well. saved ninety nine quid. <laughs> <laughs> Dog's ass hangers. Cute, but no thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. This is quite cool. Pretty sure that does well. How much is that? Two pounds. Sold. Oh, this is getting easier, this stall, isn't it? Yeah. You can come again. I'm trying, I'm trying. I always do two laps, mate, so I'll see you soon. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. Du, 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 du. How much are these little figures? That's my son's. Um, they sell the ones. I don't know what they are. Uh, that is, I'll, I'll show you on there. Where is it? Um, uh, it's a Power Ranger. Right. It's a figure. Probably the, probably the three pound vendor, isn't it? Probably. I don't know. He's only just over there. I can ask him. All right. Where is he? Over there. Yeah, that's that's great. Great. How much is that one, mate? Is that the figure on the three pound section? Is it? Yeah. And, I, and what is this? Uh, it's like a nuke storage thing. Oh, we're going to need some of that soon, aren't we? <laughs> we're going to need some nuke storage. <laughs> Did you make that? No, I got it off of Temu, I think it was. Oh, I like the look of that, but one, I don't know what I put in it. I don't smoke drugs anymore. Put your cannabis in there, wouldn't you normally? <laughs> Could do. Sorry, I forget you got. Are these your parents? Yeah. He doesn't smoke cannabis. So, uh, he's, he's old enough to know better. So. Yeah. Is that a chin? Is that a chin-up bar? Yeah. How do you extend it? Just twist it. Yeah. And how much is that? Uh, five. Five. And that's three. 
We all done it when we were younger. Yeah. And how much is have you just bought that one off Pat, have yeah, you? Yeah, I've just bought that. Yeah. <laughs> Pat's a good old boy, he is does some good deals, does Pat? Yeah, I've done him deals and he does me deals, so Fair play to you both. That's the way it goes, isn't it? Oh shit, I'll pick that up. How much are these little bits down here? They're a pound each. Is that, is that, is that wooden like a sword? Soldier sword? Yeah. Is it a letter opener? I think it's just like an ornament. That's a, is that a Timu job as well? No, I've had that for years. <laughs> Who's that? Oh, he's got his arm missing anyway. Just in case you didn't know. Oh, does it? Somebody will still buy it. Yeah, uh, so what's that, four quid? Oh, I'm tempted on that. No, I'm just going to get these, is that alright? Yeah, that's fine buddy. Thank you mate. I don't suppose you've got a bit of newspaper here from your packing, have you, or anything? Um, or just something a bit similar? If you ain't, doesn't matter. Paper, but... That little bag might, uh, that little, yeah, poo bag might do it. Just takes the edges off, doesn't it? Yeah. There you go. There you go. Oh, you can move this one, that's it, perfect. Just takes the edge off the, uh, I'm alright I'm right for that one, my lovely, yeah. so thank you. Just stops any chips and stuff. Oh look, he's well prepared, bless him. <laughs> you ain't messing around. Of course not. You Thank you, mate. Thank you. Cheers, I'm, sure mate. I'm sure you'll sell out today, I'm sure. These are quite cool, aren't they? Hopefully. Yeah, I'm sure you'll do very well. If you don't if you don't keep spending it all with Pat, you won't. No. <laughs> Thank you. Not today. Yeah, well it's hard work. That's uh What are you need in there? An elephant. Oh no are you lying? That's gonna, that's gonna become an elephant. Oh, is it all down there? Oh, look at that. I always find um, knitting. Elephant. That's, that's fantastic. <laughs> I always find knitting. It, I mean, you must watch sometimes. It's fascinating. It just turns from a ball of wool to that. I know. I mean, that's all I've got on the subject, to be honest. But <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fascinating stuff. <laughs> How much are these Rupert Dalton things? Tenner. Yeah. I'm sure it's worth that, isn't it? I'm just a tight ass. <laughs> yeah, they just, one of them just sold for £35 out of the box without the certificate. What, on eBay? Yeah. Get it on there. If you can be bothered, I suppose. How much are these? What's that? Like rubber sets. Coventry versus Arsenal rubber. <laughs> Tracy, what's that? Oh, 50p for the tea. I don't know I'll buy them. Yeah. yeah. No, but I know somebody is a Coventry fan. <laughs> Alright, thank you so much. Lovely, I appreciate thank it. You. Thank you. Good luck with the elephant. I'm sure it's going to look amazing. <laughs> Here he is, the man who's got twins. Oh, yeah. I'm filling out your bag again. Today. You're, like, you're not sure if it's a bite me or lick me. What are you buying today then? Whatever's about, really, I suppose. Like Whatever's then. cheap and cheerful. Well, everything's going cheap on my stall today. I like whiskey business. I want a dog. Is that the thing from, um, oh it's a bloody, what do you call it, Maginex, isn't it? Yeah, it's a good price, definitely I want a, what is that? Oh, that's a shame. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good thing though. Yeah, I just, could, I just couldn't imagine her using it. Oh, it's brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. <laughs> I wish she would though. <laughs> imagine her doing that. Hello, Maddie. So, can I stand on this bit? Yeah, yeah, come through, yeah, just stand, just stand across. Let's have a little look. How much are your teddies and stuff? Uh, so, the mix of um, what I thought was ready. Depends which ones you want, I suppose. <laughs> Maybe just this one. 20p. That's cheap, isn't it? Cheap! I believe that. 20p. Who are you? What else you got? Uh, Oh yeah, I see those. Yeah, yeah. How much, mate? That one there, 40. Yeah. Well, I owe you 20p. I'm going to come around here. People think you're going to run off, don't they? I think it's just that, unfortunately. You can have 50p, mate. Don't worry about the change. Thank you so much. That's it, mate. Yeah. Thanks, dude. Keep the dream alive, though. 20p prices are the proper car boot prices, aren't they? Back in the day prices. Yeah, proper tiki. I got that in Weymouth. It was um, actually 30 quid. But today it's four. 
It wasn't my bathroom. I want to see how close he looks like the Crash Bandicoot one. Do you know who I mean? Oh yeah. Um, this this one um this one I got in Portugal. Now uh, this one looks more more like it. James, who's that? What's that remind you of? Yeah, I want to see how close it looks. If, if, if it's very if it's very close, we're gonna buy it. <laughs> Crash Bandicoot Tiki. the tiki mask oh why does it look more than no it's nowhere near it oh it's close My, that's, that's childhood memory that is trying to like yeah, piece it together you almost got a sale then oh, i'm sorry lovely don't worry. i do apologize that it's, would look good on my wall if it was it, that it, it's, amazing. it's a very nice one though it still how much is it three quid i'm, I'm gonna buy it it's 90 I'm actually, less than what i paid i'm actually gonna it. buy it I think it'll still look good. But this one a little bit more sentimental because I got I got that back from Portugal. Oh yeah. <laughs> Here you go. I just, oh. Let's buy it. Yeah. Thank, thank you. you. I mean, it's yeah. got the right colours for it. It's cool. But like I said to your friend, I said what you need to do is you know build a bar in the garden or something. Yeah. And then got, it starts with a tiki, tiki mask. Tiki bar. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. I'll hold you responsible when there's a pub in the garden. Oh uh, yeah. Well, it looks you can come on. Right? Yeah. Thank you. How much is your bread maker? Four pounds. See, I keep seeing everyone pick these bloody things up. I can't have hold of them, could you? Well, oh, it's not cheap, isn't it? Very much. I know, I just need to get rid of it. Yeah, but no, four pounds too cheap for me to not buy, I think. Yeah. Or do I want to carry it around? I can keep it in your bag. No, because I'm going in a minute. I appreciate the offer, though. <laughs> Yeah, go on then, £4, I can't yeah. say no to that. Let me clear some room. Because I'm not saying it is, but even if it's broken, I've not lost much. It's not broken. I've I not lost anything. No, 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 that's what I'm saying. I'm and not you can download, I did have the book that shows you how to do You can get all that I from the website, can't you? I think it's manuals.lib or something. You can yeah, find all the manuals. Right. How much is that? That's a pound. That's a fiver, are you then, isn't it? Oh, really you. good, that. Nice, easy fiver then. There you go. Bargain. Bargains. I don't want to take it out that way. <laughs> no, fair enough. I'm roasting, I shouldn't have worn this coat. Oh, there you go, boom. Thank you, my Thank lovely. you so much, care. I appreciate Thank you it. Enjoy. I don't even know if I'm finished yet. Let me a sandwich. <laughs> Thank you so much, I appreciate that. Thank you. I'm going to go drop this off to Pat, is it, somewhere? Selling. Well, oh, it's a lot of them I thought it was going to be. Thank you so much. Is that what it is? How much is Jim? Jim? I know who Jim is. I'm going to buy him, please. It's a bit of my childhood, that is. Where's Rosie? Finally. We don't know where Rosie is. I don't know. I think she never got actually finished knitting. Poor old girl. Did you knit him? No, I think a friend of my mum's knitted them. Very well done. There you go. Thank you so much. Oh, he's even got his little bag on as well. Yeah, yeah. Mine is baby. Let's go, Rosie. His boots sometimes fall off. That's all right. I'll figure that out. Thank you so much. Right, enjoy him. <laughs> Fizzcock's coming, it's gone too late. That's a flashback, that is. Oh, look, he's even got a bald spot. You don't know who Rosie and Jim is. I don't know, YouTube it, I suppose. Stop showing off all your good stuff you brought. Oh, no, not a lot, no. Well, actually, I've got, some, I've got some decent bits. I don't think I'm even finished. I think I'm going to go around again, Pat. Yeah, we went round more today than usual. I'm going to empty off that bag into that bag. I'm give you some dish we get, we're, we're giving up red in mate, Prospect Park, because we're not finding, if we don't find any there. Well, I've got to put five in the back, so oh, I know what I'm making. Money. Delicious. Again, There's only card details, I'll exit out, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm going to go for another lap, I'll be back in a minute. So yeah, you want a vacuum right. cleaner, and what do you want? Uh, yeah. Poison gang. You're probably going to get nothing, but... Right. <laughs> Handheld vacuum cleaner. So if it's five pound, I can charge you 20, yeah? Did you find anything? Two bags. Bad. I've dropped off at the friend's car because I'm lazy. <laughs> That's nice. How's going the, the vintage? Vintage is good. It's good. You've got thing is though you've got to price it cheap. I'm pissed off on really bad offers, you know. People yeah, people, people, people do send you shit offers. Yeah. But like you've got to sort of I treat vintage like a car boot sale from my home. So okay. I don't ask So for it, example, look at Let's say for trip. example if they're twenty if you want if they're twenty quid on eBay. Yeah. I'm putting them on Vinted for yeah. 11 99 Yeah, but you put it for 11 99 Oh, somebody will offer you 6 quid. Yeah, they will. But then, 
You just can't take. You just can't take. You just can't take it personally. You have to sort of be like. I mean, I was pissed off about one cloud. I watched them. They were like looking brand new, you know. So I asked for fifty. They are two hundred. Yeah, yeah. So he he made me an offer. Twenty five. Twenty. I mean, actually, you know what the original price. Yeah. I mean, come on, the prices are raised now. Yeah, but it's, it's you just you just got to think of Vinted. Like, if you get that into your mind, Vinted is a car boot sale. People are going to haggle you, put cheap prices. It makes it easier. I'm not dealing with eBay with some, uh... because I wanted to sell a Hermes bag. Yeah, yeah. And it took me 80 quid for a sale of 700. That's not bad. Oh wait, oh they took 80 pound from you. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. that's just just about 12 percent, so, isn't it? Exactly. Yeah, it's a lot of money, but also it's a lot of money. So I'm on I'm on your side with that, but I'm also I've, I've also got a counter argument. They because of that because of eBay, yeah. you was able to put your ma your item into the world. I get it, but eight, eight, it's, it's a lot of money. It's a lot of money. It is a lot of money. Yeah, we don't pay anything. Oh, the buyer. Oh, the buyer does. Yeah. 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 You have to work it out. Yeah. Yeah. That's the thing. Eventually, eBay might catch up and start making it the same as Vinted. A lot of websites. It's only safe for clothes. It's free. Yeah, but, but only if you're a private seller as well. But I'll catch up with you anyway. Yeah. Size nine. Yeah. Size nine. Yeah. What size are these? These little dresses. Oh, I think they're mostly three and five. Oh yeah, five I mean, years. Unless you put a little string yeah. bean like my little in here, then they <laughs> fit for a bit longer. So this one is five to six. And this one is How three much are to they? Four. Ray, how much do you want to sell your cushions for, honey? One, one pound? Yeah. You're happy? Just quickly, he's already got the Alice in Wonderland outfit. In fact, don't worry, I'm just going to buy it. I'll buy that one, yeah. Thank you so much. So you're opening your bags a bit empty, you don't want anything else? I've filled it twice. I've dumped it off for a friend who's selling, yeah. Just chucked it in his car. Oh, sure, I like it. I'll give you the money, I'm sure. Thank you. Yeah, they're sort of addicted to them, aren't they? How much are them things? How much are the squishmallow? One pound fifty. One fifty, I like that. Would it get me in the good books, you think? I'll buy that as well, yeah. thank you. I can go home, right? You can stay here. You can sell everything. You can sell it all. <laughs> yeah, go home. <laughs> no, I'm joking. You keep the change, that's okay. Oh, thank you. You're most welcome. Thank you very much. Thank you. How much is your controller holder? I'm guessing that's what it is. Oh, thank you, man. I appreciate that. Is it? So, so when I get home and it's it sets on fire. If I'm honest with you, mate, the news. I mean, you come back next. I'm gonna buy it. Yeah, I'm gonna buy it. Anyway. I was the guy that asked you to sell the clothes. Oh. Me, how you doing, mate? Oh, so yeah. so if you don't sell that, yeah, no. I was like, I'm going to message him. Think, oh, yeah. yeah. So it sat there for ages, all the way through the video, and then it went on the last minute, didn't it? Yeah. I think it sold off like a tenner or a fiver. Yeah. Cheap. Because I was doing consignment at the time, yeah. so I was getting like shed loads of stuff. Yeah. I had to just sell it on. As long as I was making a profit, it didn't yeah, matter yeah. at that point. No, I'm not doing that now. Yeah, so is, what, are you an archer? Or did you just like no, that sort of, you just thought I'd buy that and sell it, yeah. We went, we went on holiday in Butlins once. I was actually quite good at it. <laughs> so you so thought you'd get a bow and say, good you are. I thought, oh, I don't mind getting another one. Sorry, man, I didn't leave it Yeah, nice one, man. I appreciate it anyway. Yeah, nice good, to, good to meet you. Yeah, you too. Mm. Oh, this is what I need to. Yeah. Ah. So, what, I said to him, when, when I put that in and the house sets on fire, I'll be back. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. How much are your clothes? Patagonias are five or eight. The rest are a pound. Oh, there's two Patagonias though, is there? That one and that one. The rest of all gone. I'd like to see Yeah, cool. Good. Love to hear that. <laughs> should have looked over this side. I was too busy looking at your bloody teddy bears. Three quid. It's not no table. They're nice. Somebody just stuck them in the fucking tumble dryer, didn't they? I've got a bundle of them. I can imagine, yeah. MK Dons. And what about the MK Dons one? Three quid. Have you looked it up? No. MK Dons. It's a big bundle of bloody clothes I've got. You know when you get to the end of it, I think you can't be bothered anymore. <laughs> I'm not going to look it up either. I'm just going to buy it. There we go. Gamble it. Risk it. How much change you got? What do you want? I'm sorry, mate. That's right. What are you getting? 
Uh, three quid with MK Dom's thing. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Close enough. Nice, three. <laughs> oh man, I feel, I, feel, I, feel, I feel like I've missed out now. Thank you so much. They were clean. Someone just dropped them on the mic. So. Oh, <laughs> well, they were. Well, well, I don't think they were. So. Everything's a pound anyway. I'm going to ask you because yeah, you know any, any, no, any splits or anything in them that you know. No, no, they, they're new. I literally, I mean, it's just they've rusted around the thing because they were outside for a bit. But yeah. I haven't worn them. They were too big. They're an eight. Yeah. But I think with those you can put in cells in. But. Yeah. What size are they? Eight. I, I think they're an eight. It's like, a bargain, yeah, that isn't yeah, it? Yeah, they're they're good. <laughs> I think people know. Do you know what? I think I'm going to buy them anyway. Yeah. All right. Because they are a bargain, aren't they? They are, yeah. You get some new insoles for them. Somebody's ob you obviously have to move them and snap the insoles, didn't you? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. yeah. I'll buy them anyway. Alright. Oh, you want pain, didn't you? What knob? Yeah, Excuse right. my language. Right. Oh, okay. right. Cheers. Well, Thank you. 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 Thank no. West Coast scenario is another good somewhere for you. <laughs> Thank, you. <laughs> Thank you. Is there going to be a 24 karat gold bracelet in there? Disguised as a spoon. It's a knife. Right. <laughs> it's funny because a, a woman bought most of them just now for the box. She didn't want what was in them. She wanted it's the one of the boxes. <gasps> Terrible actor, aren't I? <laughs> Don't tell me it's just what you were looking just for. Just what I was looking for. Well, that's the second lap done. I'm done. See you later. Thank you. That's a good price box, they are. <laughs> yeah. Just some stuff just needs to go. Of course, sure. Yeah. Free, I bet nobody takes it. You put 10p, everybody will buy it. <laughs> oh, is that where I've gone wrong? <laughs> wow. Yeah, nobody's really helping themselves. Yeah. I thought they'd rummage, but no. Oh, well. Thank you, anyway. That's Nothing for you boys. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Let's wind the viewers up, shall we? Oh, I can't see all of this good stuff. I can't see it. My eyes are blind. What is all of this? Do you have anything good for me to buy? I can't see anything. Telling them, they know they're yeah, they're, they're traders. <laughs> oh, do I wish I could find some good little games to buy? If only my eyes would work. God, that was some boot sale, that was. Got quite a few bits and pieces. I'm not too sure whether to show you it all or not. I guess I will. Probably will. You know I can speed things up, so let's not waste it. You think you've watched about 40 minutes of a video. I've actually just finished editing the car boot stuff down. Hence with the cheeky. Come on. Hence the cheeky subliminal messaging we've got over there. Come on, man. If you're watching, you haven't subscribed. Just do it. Just do it. What was I saying? Yeah, I finished. <laughs> I finished editing the car boot video. So let's not waste any more of your time or more time while I'm wasting time. While I show you what I picked up. Five pound for this. Picked it up from the chap who says he watches the channel. I remember who he. By the way, the chick. I've got a new chair. Can't talk about that just yet though, you have to pretend it doesn't exist. Haven't done the video on it yet. That's coming soon. But everything still spins. I'm still spinning. And do you know why? I thought that's that can't be right. The stool's spinning, this is spinning. There's gotta be an issue somewhere. I put a can of oil, just a round can, top of the garage. Fucking rolled right the way down to the bottom, didn't it? So it's not even the chair. This is more comfy though. Pick this up for five pounds from the chap who watches the channel. I remember him, he left a comment about a bow. Don't know about value. I'm going to guess 20, 25 probably at a push because I thought it was like a B&M thing. It's not a B&M. It's Powerstand SP2 XG Pro Exquisite Gaming. Well, it's made by the cable guys. Cable guys are quite well known for making their handheld stuff. So I thought, yeah, we'll have a bit of that because I don't have controllers or anything, but I do have phones, but I can't show you because the phone's there, although I do have a prop phone. Yeah, that's right. I have prop phones. Pretty sweet, isn't it? If I ever... Do you know what? It annoys me. It annoys me because I... I'll pick up all these cool things. You'll see some other examples. I'd love to keep that and just have it on a background somewhere. 
I don't have the space. I don't have the space for a YouTube background. Project Games actually mugged me off for it. Take a look at this. Yeah, so the collection's slowly growing. We've got the Fallout stuff, we've got the Pokemon stuff, bit by bit. One day I'll have a massive collection like Ian Masterpieces, something like this. Otherwise, I'll end up with something like this. Uh, busy weekend. Cheeky swine. I paid a fiver for that. I'll be looking to get 20, 25 out of that. I'm going to show you this because it's bothering me. Can't believe I did it. I don't ask the prices on them because if they're too cheap, I'll buy them. A lot of stuff that you see me walk by, you think, well, what is he leaving that for? Why hasn't he even asked the price? Because if it's too cheap, I have to buy it. And a lot of stuff, like I mentioned in the video, I don't care. I'm not bothered about dealing with it. Not everything that has profit left in it do I need to buy. I like to focus on the smaller stuff. Paid four quid, it's worth about 50. It's a great bread maker, bro. Lovely bread maker. Not as good as the first ladies. Bless her, I bet she's sitting there thinking, what are you lot talking about? What's wrong with my bread maker? Picks up some Eagle boots. These have never been used, ever. She said they haven't either. She just tried them on. Yeah, they've got like a, on, on the insole, where she's tried to move them around and stuff. She's like bent them a little bit. So that was just going to be mega uncomfortable on the shoe, isn't it? Mega uncomfortable. So I'm going to sell them as they are and just mention that you're probably going to be better off getting some... What are they called? Soles, heel stuff, foot padding, whatever they are. Think, take a second. Insoles, gonna get some new insoles. Eagle is a fantastic brand. Where's a logo so I can show you? There you go. If you don't know, keep your eyes open for that one. I like to show you the logo because it sticks in your brain more. So then when you're out, you'll see it. They do Wellington boots and all those kinds of things. The boots and the Wellington boots can do fantastically well. Fantastically well. These maybe 25, 30, not 100% sure on the sort of half welly, half boot kind of thing. Picked up a tracksuit set. I wanted it for myself ideally, but it's a medium. I just like the top. I'd have sat the trousers off. From 2021, a nice newer release. Quarter zip, no hood. Comes with the trousers. Five pound paid on that. Bargain. Nice little head St. Lucia bag that you saw me pick up for £4. I was going to buy this and something else. Oh yeah, the Mickey Mouse fabric, but there wasn't enough patterning on it. And a lot of you will be screaming and saying, you need to just buy it, you should have bought it anyway. I don't need to do anything. Should have, would have, could have. And all that. Paid hey, £4, it's a really nice example as well. I'm hoping 40 odd quid out of it. Really nice embroidery just there. But we shall see. Only time will tell. Time is the great revealer of all truths made it up big mouth billy bass she did actually say that it sings and stuff but the head doesn't move so that could just be a cog issue or something no i like a challenge i like a challenge me so i'll take a look at it and if it doesn't work oh well in fact it was less than two pounds she wanted two pounds for this originally 50p for some other bits and whatever else lovely lady she is and i gave her the bag and said all that's yours tell me the price uh five pound so bargain thank you very much for that by the way it's a sweet little deal I'll try and remember which bits are yours and which bits aren't, but I probably won't. Big Mouth Billy Bass, sell for about 20 odd quid if they're working. This was one of hers, still got 20 pounds. I think it was one of hers, still got 20 pounds. It's all tagged up still. You know, with me for plush, it's like 10, 12 quid a plush, and then you get some quite special ones, which you'll, you'll see in a minute. That's just how things work. That was from her as well, little monkey. 2001 Basil Brush. Boom, boom! I think this was as well, Lion King the movie thing. I think it's Lion King the movie. Pretty sure it is. Nala, innit? I've got a cat called Nala. We don't even have a cat, but. She's my cat now because they come in the house. <laughs> we have to feed them though. This just looked really special to me. You don't really see this kind of like plush stuff where there's a scene going on in, in the plush. So I thought we'll have to have a bit of that. It's a Disney store one. I don't know. I don't know. I'm hoping the £50-ish mark. That's sort of where my brain's going, but I don't know. Maybe a fiver. <laughs> what else did we get from the lovely lady? Oh, here we go. Yeah, 1993 Dougal Magic Roundabout. Still with the tag on it. Somebody has gotten gotten or got somebody's managed to secure 35 pound for that one so hopefully we can do the same and of course all of these pez dispenser you know, i paid a pound for them all the hulk minions disney princesses more disney princesses dory more disney princesses more disney princesses and darth vader that head feels well solid on that one you know, you've got to do your research and stuff. Some of the, I think these are a bit more modern. I don't think they're worth too much, but they'll sell well as a nice bundle, especially paying a pound. In fact, they would have been less than a pound as well, I'm sure, because, like I said, it's had a fire for everything. 
I think it would have come to seven pound originally. So I appreciate you again. And that is everything from Mrs. Delboy Trotter. She's a wheeler dealer, mate. She'll put half of you lot and myself to shame. Proper grafter. Picked up this 93 gold art only because it's very, very cheaply made. I say cheaply made like for 1993, it's just one of them sort of mass produced semi articulation ones. So it articulates at the shoulder and articulates at the hip. And that's it. No head, no nothing else. No, no wing articulation. It is from 1993. I picked up that and this very cool Zelda sort of probably supposed to be a, a letter opener. It's not sharp. It's just incredibly cool. That is how cool is that? Paid three pound and one pound. I think that's a steal. Don't know about the value of that. And I don't know about the value of that. I'm guessing 15 to 20. And that, I've got no idea. Not not even a clue. Can't even, can't even guess. As always, if I've had a chance, I'll screenshot. If not, don't hate me. You can always screenshot it yourself and have a little Google image search. But I always try and give you as much info as I can to help you. 50 pence the pair for these. I kept calling them rubbers while I was on the field, but they're not. They're magnets. They're from 1996. Fridge magnets. So you've got Coventry City versus Arsenal and Coventry City versus Arsenal. Just a nice, cool vintage piece. I like it. Can't show you the Disney dress because I've already given that to Ada. She loves it. Fantastic. But I need to give her this as well. Picked up a little Squishmallow for her. She loves Squishmallows, but she's never had a legitimate Squishmallow. And here one is Squishmallow. And this one is, I don't know about value. I'm not even going to bother looking it up because I don't want to find out it's worth 60 quid because it's going to hurt me when she goes, Daddy, can you get the tax off? Because I'll still give it to her. So I got her the dress and this for, I can't remember what I paid, a pound and, a pound and two pound, I think. I think I'll let her keep the change. That's the one, yeah. So it's 152 pounds. So three pound I paid for the pair. Three quid, Ada was happy days and she's going to love this later. Couldn't give that to her earlier because it was in the boot of the car. I actually used the dress to wrap my action camera up while I travelled back home because I left my case here. Two pound for Simon Flash. I thought they'd be worth way more brand new and sealed, but they don't seem to be. Somebody's got a tenner. That's probably what I'm going to be aiming for. Although it does say it comes with batteries. So I want to know if the batteries are in the bottom or if they're already inside, because if they're inside, we could be screwed. Because I think this is like 2004, 2005, something like that. 2009. Might be all right. There was a lady there doing the most incredible thing. She's not a charity. She just had tons of plush and you paid a pound and whatever number you got, you got to pick a plush from the bucket that was filled with plush. You saw what happened. So I ended up picking up little Build-A-Bear bunny with an outfit on and a Chupa Chups thing. I don't think it's an old Chupa Chups one. I don't think it's that old, but it's quite cool and funky looking regardless, isn't it? So I paid two pound for these. I just thought it was a fantastic way of doing things. So you're not a charity and it's not a raffle where you could either win nothing or win junk. It's one it's one product, it's plush. So you know you're going to get a plush regardless. I just thought that was quite fun. Quite a cool way of doing things. So I might keep that. I might have a side stall next season when I do car boots again. I might do something like that. Woolly and Tig, they always sell quite fast. They fly out. As soon as you list them, they're pretty much gone. As long as you list them like me, you look past them to sell. You know what I mean? 50p I paid for that, I think. Oh no, it's 20p. That was right. This geezer smashing out stuff for like 10p, 20p. What a lad. Give him 50p and say, keep the dream alive, mucker. Jim! His little boots fell off. I'll put it back on. I'll give you that respect. You gave me so many years of happiness and joy. Jim. One half of Rosie and Jim. I wish I had Rosie. I feel quite sad for you, actually, boy. Rosie and Jim. I'm old. I'm 80s. I'm a millennial. Yeah, we've gone from being the annoying bratty millennial to being the old moany fake boomer of the people. But that's the way life goes, isn't it? This is Jim. Somebody hand knitted him. Hand knitted versions can still sell for mega dough. But I'm not saying this one's going to be worth like mega dough. It does have a bald spot though. <laughs> they obviously just went, well, we don't need to do that bit, do we? Because you don't. Fantastic. I love it. Really well done as well. I'm hoping 20 to 30, but I'm also not that bothered if it doesn't sell. It has to hang around here for a bit. Hoogabooga! Tiki mask. I picked him up because, well, Crash Bandicoot. I thought it was going to be very similar to that. My brain just wasn't really computing and putting the two images together. And it was recalling it and then saying, yeah, that looks like it. It's not. It's not, it's not even close. Similar colours, though. I think that's really, really cool. I've just been editing the video now. She said £4. 
And then when I said, no, I don't want it, and after a bit of a conversation, and then I twisted my own arm, I said, how much was it again? Genuinely forgot what she said. She had three pounds, so yeah, made in Indonesia. Just a really cool piece. Another thing, like, yeah, I'd have that somewhere. I am gonna start decorating this wall though. Matt's made me feel very conscious. Thanks for the games. You're welcome, Dan, brother. Interrupting my filming, how dare you? It's my own fault, it's my own fault. Thingy Bird from The Lion King. That's all I'm gonna to say to you, Thingy Bird. I can't remember, it's from the actual musical one. Paid a pound, one pound. I think I offered him a hundred pound first. MK Dons, I've done a little bit of research. I think it's 15 to 16 year, the 2014 to 2016. Uh, it's a long sleeve, which is better than a short sleeve, obviously. And people have been getting around about 20 to 35 pound on the short sleeves alone, and I'm still spinning. Didn't even solve the problem. So with the long sleeve, I'm gonna be washing it and then listing it for about 49.99 and seeing what happens, unless, of course, I go to do the research and it says long sleeves are £100. Then I'm still going to list it for £49.99. All right, let's get rid of the elephant in the room. <laughs> turtle. Squirtle. Squirtle the turtle. Me and Pat was at a different car boot sale a little while ago, and he said to this lady who just pulled up, how much is your squirtle in the window? Because she hadn't got out yet. And she went, £2. And I went, fair play to him. Now, I've bought it for £5. He is, I think he's an original. Yeah, 2018, Toy Factory. Still with the tag on it, which really sort of got me a bit more interested in it. Pat paid £2, I paid £5. I'm going to list it for about £25. I'm pretty sure that's the going rate. I can't remember. I got 18 for one before, which wasn't tagged. I'll list this for about £25 and see what happens. I don't know if that's a repair or if that's just some, you know, extra stitching somebody's put in there, but... You know, the other leg's quite smooth. That leg's got a bit of a roughness to it. Who cares? Who cares? Squirtle. Nice bean filled, really, really light. Just like the last... What was the last one I had? Was it Pikachu or was it... Snorlax? Weren't Snorlax. Can't remember. I had one, but it might have even been a Squirtle, to be fair. In fact, I think it was a Squirtle. I'm having, I'm having memory recall. I think it was a Squirtle. I think it was a Squirtle. And I'll pick this up as well. Nice little Kenji from the same lady that I got all the other bits from. Nice little squishy Kenji doll. Hooded. You can take the hood off if you want. What's up, gangster? Yeah, yeah. It's nice. Little Kenji doll. I don't know what it's worth. Probably 15 quid, if that. Maybe. Could be worth a bit more. Just think Kenji's cool. I also picked up a shooting stick. I love my shooting sticks. I haven't even looked at this yet to see if there's a brand on it. Is it made by anyone? Nope, just made in Pakistan. So I sell the Pakistan one still for about 18, 20 quid. Made in England sell for quite a bit of money as well. But uh, this will still sell nicely. Paid one pound. But of course, I've been saving some interesting things until last. I picked up one, two, three, four, five jelly cats. For, they were 20 pence each, so a pound. I gave her two pound, of course. I just pulled out whatever change I had and just give her two quid. Now, I'm not going to like pull out them and be like, oh, I'll have a tenner because some of them could only be worth three or four quid. Some of them could be worth 12 quid, whatever else. However, I think I might've hit a little bit of a jackpot here. I am, I do need to do a bit more research first and double check, all right? But I'll show you what we got. We've got a nice little jelly cat bunny. Yeah, bunny, bunny, bunny. I think he's a yak. And I think that one's worth a little bit of, a little pretty penny. Got a little poppet monkey. Not sure about the value on most of these, but I have rough ideas on some. And we've got these two, which I think are going to be the most valuable. Now, of course, you jelly cat experts could be sitting there saying, I don't know what you're talking about, mate. No chance. Whatever. And then I'm going to waffle on in a minute for no reason. So I'll do my research fully later and realise it's not as good as I thought. But for some reason, this seems to be really hard to find and get hold of. Wouldn't they call it a, a dumpling? duckling or dumpling something medium sized dumpling chick or something like that somebody sold one for like 256 quid on bids i don't know how true that is but outside of that i can't find one so i'm like did it sell for that because they're hard to get or what's the crack there is a really small version as well which does sell consistently for about 70 80 quid that's what i've seen anyway please tell me if i'm wrong all right, please correct me. I'm happy to learn. I try not to speak like I know it all because I'm always open to education. Education is important. But yeah, we've got this one 
and the Liberty fabric, I think it's Liberty of London teamed up. Normally you see this Liberty fabric in the ears. Remember when I got excited about the build bear that was covered in lots of special things in the ears? Then I did some research and realized it's actually the Jelly Cats with the floral in the ears because they did a team up with Liberty of London. I've got a little scarf to list actually from Liberty somewhere. A little bit worn on the tags and stuff. Looks like, oh, I can't work it out. This is very, very worn through on the tags. Jelly 1526. But this one, somebody has got £35 for on bids alone. Tiny little one on bids. So what's it really worth? And again, this one, I've got no idea. So I'm going to have to do a little bit of re pudding. Not, what's it called? Dumpling. I think it's called a pudding. Just come to my brain. So for that car boot sale, considering I wasn't even going to go at all, I think we did really, really, really well. I was in two months whether to sell or whether to buy. And I went and just bought. And I only went to one. And I'm glad I did. Well, I'm absolutely knackered now. I need to finish this video off and go and edit that one down. Clear some space ready to make a sales video tomorrow. Got lots to pack. On that note, let's do a giveaway. And do you know why I like to do giveaways? Because you've made it this far to the end of the video, haven't you? You made it this far. By the way, Madame, who's won the sticker, I have just finally got round to finding it again. I lost it. So this will be going out tomorrow. All right, Tracy, I'm sorry. Going out tomorrow. Today starts today, Sunday. What can we give away? Let's give away something from today. We're going to give away the official Kennedy Space Centre Astro Chimp. It's got a little backpack. You can actually put things in it as well. You can like, stash bits in there, whatever you want. You take his backpack off. Really cool little space chimp. I think John would call it like that, to be fair. But he's not having it. One of you guys are. All you've got to do is comment down below, whatever you want. Just interact with me, talk to me about the video, say something, and you will be entered. One day, somebody's going to be a dick in the comments, and they're going to win it. <laughs> but I bet they don't give me their address, do they? Thank you so much for watching, guys. I do appreciate it. Don't forget to comment down below and like the video while you're at it. Bloody well, subscribe. I'll see you in a bit. Love you. Bye. <gasps> oh, my God.